What's up, Mona is here. Welcome to my travel vlog. And in this vlog, I'm taking you to the city of Golden Friendship, Cagayan de Oro. So this is the second part of our city of Bukidnon trip. And if you haven't watched part one yet, go check it out on my YouTube channel. Today's adventure involves an exciting activity, whitewater river rafting. The tour company picked us up from our Airbnb at 7 a.m. and took us to the starting point of the river. Prior to the activity, we received a comprehensive orientation and some training to prepare us for the rafting experience. Opting for the beginner's trail, we tackled the lower section of the river, which covered a distance of 12 kilometers and lasted for approximately 2 to 3 hours, featuring 14 thrilling rapids along the way. The activity was incredibly fun, especially as we navigated through the rapids, and we enjoyed it so much that we even contemplated booking the expert trail for an even more exhilarating experience. The cost of the activity was 1,200 pesos per person, which covered guides, equipment, and transportation. So, a little bit background of the Cagayan de Oro guys. It is also known as CDO. It is a bustling city situated in the Misadis Oriental area of northern Mindanao, Philippines. Its reputation as a premier spot for thrill seekers is primarily due to the variety of exhilarating activities available such as white water rafting, zip lining, and kayaking, making it an ideal destination for those seeking an adventure. The optimal time to experience white water river rafting in CDO is between July to December as the river swells during this period providing an exciting challenge for rafters seeking an unforgettable adventure. During its calmer months, the water is crystal clear and sustains the lush flora and fauna in the surrounding areas. However, despite visiting in March, we found that the experience was still just as enjoyable as it would have been during the peak season. Following our exhilarating rafting adventure, we returned to the city center where we enjoyed a delicious lunch at Ayala Centrio before making our way to the airport for our flight back to Cebu City. And that concludes our journey for today and we appreciate you tuning in. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for future updates.